Princess Kate seeks solace and a sense of optimism in the serene surroundings of Adelaide Cottage, where she resides with her beloved children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. Hello, welcome to Royal Diaries. Before we continue please subscribe to the channel for more British royal family news. Following her hospitalization for abdominal surgery earlier this year, the Princess of Wales revealed that she is currently undergoing preventative chemotherapy, prompting her to temporarily withdraw from her royal responsibilities and focus on her recovery in the comforting presence of her husband, Prince William, and the three cherished children. Situated on King Charles's Windsor estate, in close proximity to Lambrick School, attended by George, 10, Charlotte, 8, and Louis, 5, the family of five has been creating cherished memories within the walls of Adelaide Cottage. Recently, during the Easter holidays, they also enjoyed a retreat to their magnificent country mansion, Anna Hall, located on the picturesque Sandringham estate in Norfolk. Renowned royal commentator Jenny Bond emphasizes that as the weather improves, Kate will find solace and joy in spending time outdoors within the splendid gardens of her Windsor residence. She affirms that the coming months of recuperation will be greatly enhanced by the serene ambience of the natural surroundings, providing the princess with reassurance and a sense of optimism. Bond shares her insights, stating, I'm certain that Catherine will derive immense solace from the tranquility of her gardens and the sheer delight of being outdoors during this period of recuperation. The winter months in the UK can be rather dreary, particularly when one is recovering from significant surgery, but the blossoming of spring offers a beacon of hope. Continuing her remarks, Bond adds, Catherine has always drawn strength and inspiration from nature and the beauty of outdoor life. There is an undeniable reassurance and a sense of renewed hope that accompanies the emergence of green shoots in spring, especially when one has personally sown the seeds of growth. She may have even involved her children in the joys of gardening, witnessing the thrill of those first tender green sprouts, symbolizing new life, new beginnings, and the cyclical nature of existence. Kate's ardent advocacy for the positive impact of spending time outdoors on mental and physical well-being is well known. Throughout the years, she has openly expressed her deep affinity for the great outdoors, recognizing its profound influence on personal happiness and vitality. Notably, she has passionately shared anecdotes about her own gardening adventures, including her unique method of growing potatoes in sacks which she candidly revealed in 2012. In 2019, the Duchess of Cambridge made a memorable debut at the prestigious RHS Chelsea Flower Show with her Back to Nature Garden, showcasing her commitment to connecting individuals with the healing power of nature. Last year, she lent her support to the Royal Horticultural Society's campaign for school gardening which aims to introduce young minds to the wonders of gardening and the natural world, fostering a deeper appreciation for the environment. As Princess Kate embarks on her journey of recovery, she finds solace, inspiration, and renewed hope in the tranquility and beauty of her Windsor Gardens. With her children by her side, she embraces the restorative power of nature, nurturing her soul amidst the blossoming flora and the promise of brighter days ahead. Thanks for watching till the end, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more updates.